Our next choice is grilled crocodile. I have no idea what to expect. What if I'm allergic to crocodile? And you finished it. Amici. Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. We are now here at the Chiang Rai Night Market or Night Bazaar. And tonight we're gonna eat. We're gonna show you all the food we're gonna eat. There's gonna be a lot of good food, so let's go. So right now we're trying to eat little portions just because we want to try a little bit of everything. They also have very big portions, but we're going to save them for later. Oh, sorry. Yeah, about five minutes. Okay, thank you. Alright guys, for the first food we got squid tentacles grilled. Food is here, so they took it out from the stick. I thought it was going to be a skewer, but no. But anyway, it's cooked. We have a dipping sauce and looks like there's a lot of um what do you call it? Cilantro, right? It has to be cilantro. I know already this sauce is gonna be spicy. Is it very spicy? Mmm. Mmm. It's like the green sauce, but I like it. Mmm, I like it. It's not hard. It's tender. <coughs> spicy. <laughs> My turn. I know this sauce is very spicy for me, so I'm gonna put just a tiny bit. Good, right? <laughs> mm, it's very light, nicely seasoned, not chewy at all. I like it. This grilled squid was 50 bucks. Off to the next one. Our next choice is grilled crocodile. I have no idea what to expect. You like spicy? I have no idea how it's gonna be. The crocodile meat is gonna be my first time as well. It's weird. Okay. Moment of truth. Moment of truth, guys. It's supposed to be quite spicy. You can see it because it's so red. So let's give it a shot. It's very hot. Oh, it's hot. It's spicy. It's spicy. Um, it actually tastes in between chicken and pork. It's it's a weird flavor. It's very interesting. The texture is very nice. It's soft. I was expecting something very, very chewy, but actually it's very tender. It has the same consistency as the chicken, just a little bit rougher. Maybe in between chicken and... Yeah, chicken and pork, I would say. And the spice, the spice is very, very nice. It's my turn. There's a moment of truth. It's my first time eating crocodile. It just it smells like chicken barbecue. Yeah. Chake, satay chicken. Chicken satay. Mmm. It's a lot chewier. It's more chewy. No, not that chewy. It's actually very good. Very spicy. Oh, that meat. The second bite was not chewy. Yeah, it's tender that one. Chicken slash pork, for real. If I didn't know that it was crocodile, I wouldn't know that it was crocodile. I would just think it was chicken or pork. It's very good. The flavor is there, spot on. I think I would need some sauce though to dip this in, but it's good. So I got chicken barbecue because after that crocodile, I need something not foreign to my taste buds. <laughs> What if I'm allergic to crocodile? And you finished it. <gasps> Amici. So that crocodile was 30 baht. Now, for only 15, we got this beautiful, ooh, saucy chicken on a screw. First bite is going to be the pineapple. We all know how pineapple tastes. Is it hot? Is it good? I leave to Yanni the chicken. Since this is my order, I get the chicken first bite. Mmm. It doesn't taste like... Texture doesn't taste like chicken, but it's chicken. Allegedly. 
<laughs> Allegedly. It's good. It tastes like crocodile again. Uh -huh. mm. Mm. It's a bit sweet, a bit spicy. I feel like the sausage is a sweet and sour sauce. And the chicken is nicely grilled. It's tender. I hope it's cooked properly. But it's good. My turn. You're right. Is it cooked properly? <laughs> Sorry, wait a second. It is. You spit it out I and did. you ate it back in. I'd rather do that than get food poisoning. <laughs> Yen is right. The texture is not like chicken at all. Not what we are used to. It's very good. But at first when I beat it, I was like, oh my god, is this raw? Because it just my teeth went through it. It's a younger version of us. You see so many different dishes here and so many different flavors. It's beautiful. Also, the market is starting to get so packed, it's so hard to walk now. Basically, they don't have the change for our thousand baht, so we're just waiting for it. Perfect. And after spending basically all our money, all the money we brought today, we're having our final meal for 100 baht and it's crispy spare ribs. It looks delicious. Let's see if it is. There are two different sauces. I know for sure this one is spicy. This one is gonna be very spicy. This is probably a bit sweeter. I'm scared of the bones. There's a bone. Flavor is delicious. It's um, a little bit chewier because there's a little bit of fat in it and there's a bone in it, so <laughs> be careful. But it's very, very good. Hi y'all, my turn. So let me just say my, my tolerance for spice has gone up since I've been here in this country. So I can eat a whole chili because this morning for breakfast there was a whole chili and I ate it. No problem. So let's go for the spicy sauce. And also anything deep fried is good. So this was deep fried, so it should be good. Mm, it's a bit chewy. Mm. Not loving the chewiness. But the flavor is good. I need to floss tonight. The flavor is very, very good. <coughs> Spicy. Now, the sweet sauce. Mmm. It's sweet. Mmm, good. Do you have spoon? How many spoons? One, two, three. Okay, guys. For dessert. I've been eating this since I got here. Ask Fabio. I got... Oh my god, there's a lot of stickers. I got mango with sticky rice. So they give you, every time you order mango sticky rice, they give you this milk sort of kind of thing that you're supposed to pour on the mango and sticky rice. Yum! I'll just pour it in. So I tasted the milk separately and the milk is kind of sour, which balances with the sweetness for both the mango and the sticky rice. Mmm! I will forever eat this until I'm here in Thailand. <laughs> okay, so food is done. Now we are gonna go to the shopping area. We'll show you that. Let's go. And now we're entering the shopping area, which is full of beautiful handmade stuff. And we're gonna show them to you. Fabio is in vlogging duty because I'm still eating my mango sticky rice. This market is huge. There's a lot of corners. I think it's as big as the uh, Chiang Mai night market. But I could be wrong. It's good. It's big. So this was our night out at the night market. Lit. We had good food. The interesting one was the crocodile, definitely. Absolutely. But it was amazing. And now we are closing this vlog because we're tired. We're gonna go home and sleep. Thank you for coming out with us. Good night. Oh, that's Position the sound.